What's going on everyone? Thanks for stopping by and hope you guys are having a good day. I am Josh from VHU and as you can see we are in pretty familiar territory. We're in Good Springs, there's Doc Mitchell's house. We're taking a look at a gun here. It's a 9mm remake, uh, if you can't tell by the title. Uh, somebody added this, it was kind of they remade their own version of their own gun that they own, I guess. Uh, there was one just added to the Nexus website that looked really good, I wanted to do, but uh, I can't seem to get it to work right. But this one looked really awesome, so we're going to check it out. Uh, once you install the mod via the link below, you're going to head, this is Chet's store. Uh, you see the workbench and the reloading bench. Uh, right beside this window by these um, crates, you're going to see Kevin's crate, and there's the PT-92. So it's the 9mm PT-92 handgun, so it is a slight variation. It comes with 900m rounds, clean, and a silenced version as well. So there are no attachments per se, there are just a one vari different variations of each gun. So we're going to go ahead and equip them. So the first one we're going to take a look at is a clean version. And that's the gun. So the gun looks really good. I mean, it's kind of dark. The shadows aren't great, I think. I don't know if this gun, though, by default is a um, is just a natural uh, matte paint, um, where it's, it, it, it is supposed to be dull like that. I'm not really sure. Um, but it does have custom sounds and everything, and the gun looks incredible. It's actually in really good detail. Um, yeah, that's amazing. It, it turns out, like, the textures, like I said, aren't great, because it is kind of dark. Um, but the actual model of the gun is incredible, so let's fire this baby. So that's a really good sound. And you can see the gun action there from the uh, from the trigger there, the hammer. That's awesome. Okay, let's take a look at the other version. This is the dirty version. So you can see this was a little bit better. I like this one a little bit better because you can kind of see more details on the gun. Um, same thing. Let's see if I can hit this guy. Alright, so that's that gun. We got one more to take a look at, and this is a silenced one. Actually, we should look at the damage. So they both have damage per second of 73, damage of 19 per single round, value of 100, and 17 round magazine. So they're pretty standard. They're not overpowered by any means. So this is a silenced version. So the silenced version is dirty. Oh, wow, that sounds really good. Holy shit, that's the best sounding silencer I've seen. Wow. There's not the greatest aim down the sights here. The silencer kind of interferes with that, but I think that's uh, an issue that's addressed in a later version of this gun. I'm not really sure. There we go. So yeah, it isn't very accurate, but I think I downloaded the version that did not have the improved accuracy with the scope. Uh, but I really like this. This is awesome. Oh. Got him. So, you know, I don't think it's that inaccurate. Maybe I do have the, uh, the accurate version. I'm going to take out Easy Pete here. Gotcha, bitch. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this mod. Definitely check this out. For, in terms of 9mm remakes, I'm, I'm a huge fan of this gun. Like, during my playthroughs and stuff, you guys don't see it when I play this game, though. I, I really like to use this gun. Um, so it's definitely something that's worth checking out for sure. If you're looking for some remakes of some guns, like, it's not a complete remake because it's more of a custom version. But uh, it's, a, it's a hell of a lot of fun to use, guys. So make sure you check this out. It's in the description below. And that don't have a whole lot more to say. Hope you guys have a phenomenal day. Peace out, guys.